You asked, and I delivered. Brought some snow home from my western vacation. Snow on snow south of Boston. First time I've had this, and now it's beautiful weather. That's how it's been. From sea to shiny sea, it has been coast to coast storms this week. Every resort, I think, in North America has picked up some snow. Jackpot for the Wednesday night event, Wisp, Maryland. Seven inches new. For us further northeast, it's the second snowfall of the week. We had snow on President's Day. Beautiful sunshine. Look at the kitty cardboard box race at Wildcat. Oh, I love it when the families get out in blue sky day. That was so pretty. And then it snowed again. Last night, we picked up another, I don't know, about five inches, I think, here at Sugar Loaf. Sweet, sugary snow on a little bit of a hard surface, says Bob and Nancy Hennessy at Sugar Bush. And now we have a, co a quiet couple days. The blue sky has just come out in Boston. It's about 45 degrees at the ski resorts. It's freezing. And we get a little upslope snow in the mountains of New York and Vermont, northern New Hampshire for our Friday. And then on Saturday, it looks beautiful. Big high pressure system. But look at this map. Oh, my goodness. It's the kitchen sink storm. Another one. It's a mammoth storm from Canada to the Gulf of Mexico. There is some snow on the front side of that in northern New York to northern Maine, Quebec, and Ontario. Saturday night that arrives. Sunday looks like a messy day. It'll be a wintry mix across the mountains from Mount Mansfield to Mount Katahdin. Canada, once again, gets the most snow out of this. Ontario and Quebec get a couple of feet. Most of New England's going to get at least a little rain. Sunday does not look good. It's going to go back to snow Sunday night. And boy, is that a mega wind. It is lift hold city on Monday, but it's also snowing a little bit. Uh, that wind will relax. Very cold air, nice dry air coming in for Tuesday. And then we're going to have a series of storms to finish February and begin March. Looks like the next one comes in on Wednesday, mostly snow, maybe a mix towards the mid-Atlantic. Uh, it's a really volatile pattern. You can't really trust the 10-day forecast, but uh, we get paid to do it anyway. Uh, you ask for it, we give it. Looks like next weekend could be big, the entire East Coast. Uh, March is a classic month for big storms, and that's how it's looking for now. Hope you're getting out and enjoying this. We'll see you on the slopes. Yeah, that's my garden. Uh, I can't wait to start it. Well, actually, I can't wait. And over here, this is where I'm farming some snow. Yep, this is right. 23-inch snow drift here, just south of Boston. It's dripping now, but uh, birds are at the feeder. Look at that sky. Do you know the jet stream uh, over New England broke a record this week at 240 miles per hour? That's what happens when it's 90 degrees in Florida and 30 below in Montana. So no matter what you picked, a ski vacation or a Florida vacation, you got it this week.